In order to preserve your world and make it a habitable place for future generations, the physical environment must be your first priority. This will have a beneficial effect on your behavior, on your relationship with others, and on every aspect of your culture and society. Many people today have lost sight of the utter dependence they have on their environment to provide them with bare essentials of life, food, water, shelter, and clothing, and to make possible all of the conveniences and benefits they enjoy to whatever extent these things are available to them. The new message from God emphasizes that the world's environment must be preserved and well cared for if humanity is to have a future. For if this is not done, humanity will decline, human conflict will escalate, and human deprivation and suffering will increase dramatically. While this is apparent to a few people today, what many people do not realize is if humanity were to decline in this way, you would be extremely vulnerable to persuasion and influence from forces from the greater community, the greater community of intelligent life in the universe in which your world exists. There are many races today who are watching humanity, waiting for an opportunity to gain advantage here, waiting for an opportunity to gain access to this world's immense biological resources waiting for an opportunity for humanity to be in a state of desperation where such influences will have tremendous impact. At this moment, humanity assumes its preeminence in the world. It feels it has a God-given right to be in this preeminent position within the world. But within the greater community, humanity is a weak, divided, and self-obsessed race occupying and stewarding a planet of immense value and importance to others. Never think that you can just go into space and claim whatever resources that you have wasted here upon the earth. For those resources are owned by others. Never assume that the universe is just a vast empty place awaiting human exploration and human exploitation. For you are not alone in the universe or even within your own world at this time. The ignorance and the arrogance of such assumptions must be corrected, or humanity will make fatal mistakes that even God and God's angels will not be able to offset. That is why there is a new message from God in the world, because humanity is destroying its self-sufficiency. Humanity is standing at the edge of space, and humanity is already experiencing forces that are intervening in its world without its control and without its permission.